Good morning, everybody. Grandpa Adler Farms, how are you this morning? I hope the Adler Farms family's having a good day, good night, whenever you're watching this. It's raining out here today, folks, and it has been raining for, I don't know, 12 hours, maybe, something like that, and we're supposed to get another three or four hours coming at us. So I've got two choices. Now, today is my normal film day, all right? Now, I can make it easy on myself, and I can put off feeding these animals for three or four hours. But you know what? That's not fair to them. So the animals have already gathered. I'll show you in a minute. They've already come down. So they know, hey, it's time to eat. We'll make this happen. Uh, I've got some uh, good news about Smokey. It, it is good news. Uh, we're waiting on uh, how the progress goes. So that, that you're going to want to stick around for that. Uh, let's get things done first. And I'm going to tell you exactly where we're at with Smokey because I, I got the urine sample, the most recent one. Got it down there. They analyzed it. So we got to talk about that. All right, well, that's enough yakking. I kind of just wanted to set that up. So let's make this happen. Get Smokey your medicine. See if we can get her to eat. But when she comes down, I believe she's hungry. I know the goats are. So bear with me if I have to. Uh, actually, Grandma will have to do some creative editing. But bear with me because I'm going to take the umbrella with me. And, uh, oh, this is going to be fun. Stick around, all right? <laughs> Stick around. Whee! Here we go. Let's grab uh, Smokey's food here and we'll keep her under the umbrella. The birds, oh man, oh, it happened again. I don't know how, but see the, look. Mm. Something knocked the fence down again. So we gotta get that stood back up. I don't know if it's deer or, or what. It could be deer, probably most likely a deer, a deer comes charging through. It's rained so much that I'm looking for tracks, but I don't, I don't see any. Mm, all the other fence, everything is, is, is up. Bear with me. I'm trying to adjust this as I go here and make sure y'all can see what's going on. Okay, let's uh, take Smokey's food. Now there's the goats right there. They were down here. They were. They spent the night up there. And then as it rained, I got to steal Smokey's food. They came down here to the porta huts, but now they they know I'm out here, so they'll probably make their way back up there. Smokey is, I can see her. Uh, she's wandering around down there, and you may not be able to see her. There, there she is. She's wandering around down there on the north side. She's all right. All right. Well, let's get in here first. Let's go do the chicken. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this her food, Smokey's food. I'm going to put it under this lid. Tell you what, too. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the camera because this can go under the tarp, under the chicken tarps here while I get their food ready. This is kind of fun. Get this open up here. All right. Good morning, girls. How are you? Now, I'm going to run back out here, get the food. I've got a uh, rain suit, so it's worked. I bought it last year, and it works really, really well. So I don't get wet, except for my hands. I'm going to give them a little scratch, a little bit of egg food. Egg food. When I say egg food, it's that egg max. It's not egg maximizer. I'm actually getting it now from our, our local ag store. They don't call it egg maximizer, it's just a, a high protein egg pellet. This is 18% uh, instead of the 21. I feel like it's going to be a little bit better. I feel like it's maybe it's more of a natural uh, blend than what I've been using perhaps because it comes from an ag store. Maybe that's just in my head. I'm going to pour this in here. Now you can see the girls, they are over there underneath the other, other shelter hanging out. I'll open the door. I doubt if any of them's in there. We'll see. They may come out. Let's go see who's in the coop. Hey, before we go in, I apologize. Somebody had asked where this coop came from. And I'm going to shoot that right there like that. That's who we bought the coop from, okay? I do not know how far and wide they would go. But if you're more than welcome to call them and see what they can do if you're interested. Somebody had asked me that in a comment, and I failed to get back with them. My apologies. Let's get the wormies out. I think our wormy dance will be a combination 
rain dance even though we don't need the rain. Hi girls. We'll open this up today. It's 43 degrees, a little bit chilly. And as you know, in my last video, I was out here and I had my shorts on. Woo wee! Had my shorts on and I apologize that, that some of you didn't wear your sunglasses prior to watching that and my legs probably darn near put your eyes out. So I'll work on that tan. All right, let's, uh, let's do our scratch. I'm going to put it here because it rains out here a little bit. Someone said the other day, say, hey, Grandpa, you're giving them too much food. That scratch is on the ground there. You know, they're not eating it. I put food in here. Of course, they eat, as, they eat it as they want. But the scratch, they don't eat the, they'll leave a lot of the corn. I, I don't know why, but they don't eat that corn. They'll eat all the other little grains in there and they leave that corn. So it kind of, you know, I know it looks like there's a lot on the ground. I raked it out the other day and I keep it raked out for that very reason. But you know, it is what it is. Uh, they, they don't need it all, but I'm, I'm gonna still give them scratch. Of course, scratch is more of a snack than it is anything, I guess, or a, a, kind of a treat. But I don't know, I've seen other videos and people throw scratch out, so I'm throwing scratch out. And they get the egg layer food. So what do you think, girls? We're, we're good, ain't we, about that? We're good on that, ain't we, huh? It's all right, we'll rake it out there and something out there will eat it. All right, let's get going. Let's do the wormy dance, and then I'll hand out the wormies. I'm not sure I'll give them to chase a mouse today, but uh, you ready, girls? Let's get this thing kicked off. Come on, we got to get warmed up. One, two, one, two, three, go. Dun da dun 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 da dun 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 da dun dun da 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 it's getting change it up let's change it up we'll just start doing you know tell what we'll do we may even do the old 70s how about that we'll start doing that huh is that how you do that grandpa's silly i'm as silly as i can be you want some wormies girls shoot grandpa we don't want anything to do with you you done lost your mind come here you girls want wormies I don't know if we'll be mouse chasing today or not. They're not wanting to come outside. And... Old Magneto looks like a drowned rat over there. Here, girls, let's get your, let's put their uh, wormies here. We've got a nice, under this canopy here, we have a nice dry 10, 12 feet that they can uh, stay under and eat, you know. So we'll put the wormies under here and they'll come out as they want. And get them. Here they come. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There's a couple over there somewhere. Oh yeah, hi Mags. Rain's picked up again. Good, great. Oh boy. Morning Magneto. You're getting wet out there, son. Huh? You're getting wet out there. There we go, Daisy. Morning, Harriet, Laverne, and Shirley, Blondie, Goldie, Reba, Ginger, Mary Ann. Lucille, Little Red. How is everybody this morning? <coughs> Miss Nelly. She's over there somewhere. She's over there somewhere. I'll take a peek at her before I go make sure she's okay. Let's look in here and see if they got any eggs. I took a lot of this straw out because it was getting kind of muddy. And I thinly spread it. I didn't want to get too much in here, but we've had so much rain it just looks muddy in here and I didn't like it. Oh, there's one egg down there. Let's go ahead and get that one from last night. Put that in my egg print. By the way, I keep those, uh, these are those prefab. Uh, somebody poo pooed in there. Yuck, get that out. Those prefab nesting, you put them in a nesting box in a little straw, you know. So I keep those on hand and they're easy to clean. And so there we go. And they like them. All right, girls, let's go. I want to do a real quick check on Miss Nellie. Here we go. Let's go back here. Make sure she's all right. I haven't seen her. I haven't heard her. Let's go see. She's probably hiding from... Is she back here? Where's Miss Nelly? Oh, there she is. <laughs> Hi, Nelly. Hi, honey. There we go. Everybody's good. Everybody's happy. Okay, girls. I'm going to go take care of the goats and the doggy. You guys, you girls stay dry. Somebody asked me what kind of chickens were sassy and gray. 
I don't know. I'll have to ask Chad. You know me. Oh, I, I know about two different kinds of them, and after that, I lose control. I lose control. I, I don't. I, I don't. I don't keep track. That kind of stuff, honestly, it just does not stick in my head. I don't know why. I don't know why. I mean, if I have to get more chickens, I'll say, "Hey, what do I get?" I'll go get them. They lay eggs. Good. That's all I care about. You know, I'm sometimes it's like this. I don't care how it works, just as long as it works. Are you with me? Okay. I gotta go turn the water on, and I don't have an umbrella, thumbrella, but uh, I left it over there. I'm gonna turn the water on. I'll be right back. I got my hood on. All right, Daisy, you're getting wet, young lady. Huh? Do you care? Maybe she's waterproof. Well, I'll tell you one thing too. They've been coming out here and getting all kinds of worms, man. They digging in this mud because those worms have come to the surface and they are getting all kinds of worms out here. So that's a good thing. I set my umbrella up on top of the, those are trap. They're not, they're not operating. I, I don't have anything in there, those live traps right now. In fact, that's what I want to sit down there for the fox. I just haven't had a chance to do it. And no, I have not seen the fox since that day that I sprayed that vinegar around. But, Oh, my umbrella blue come over here. I'll tell you what, I don't know about you folks, but sometimes I make things really hard on myself. You know what? You ever done that? Well, that wind is a little bit breezy. All right, so we are inside now with Smokey. And uh, I'm going to take her little dish. Let's take this and move this in a little bit so when she eats, it gets her body out of the rain. Here, honey. No, Batman. No. Every day. That's all right. That's all right, honey. It's okay, Smoke. Hang on. You got to get back. Get out of here. Get out of here. Let me do it this way. Come here, Smoke. Come here, honey. I got you, kiddo. So we're going to take her medicine. Got it in cheese ball here. Cheese ball form. Put it in here. Like so. All right. There we go, girl. Damn. Here we go, honey. Come on, babe. Come here, honey. There's your food. I'll get her going. Let me get this. Batman, stay right where you're at. Don't you dare come in here. Get back. Get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. Move it. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. We'll get you going. Atta boy. Now, the best we can do for her. Hey. Hi, Miss Kitty. I know. I didn't forget about you. I'll get your food here in just a little bit, honey. Now, here's how it's been working out. She eats in here. Well, they go with me down there and uh, works out pretty good. The only thing I get a little bit concerned about, you know, she took off, Miss Kitty did, she took off of that cheese the other day. And I've been kind of waiting to see Smokey We'll eat her food and get that cheese down. But she is so picky. It takes her forever to start eating. So I got to give her a second. Either that or Miss Kitty follows me down here. Hang on a second. Maybe I can get her to do that. Look at that right there. Batman, Miss Kitty. He is really getting to know her. Smokey, honey, your food is over here. Miss Kitty's eating her egg and she will not relinquish her position. So... We're getting familiar. Smokey's done went in the wrong one. Well, as you can see, I've been joined by the uh, brother's goat here. <laughs> they don't want to get in the rain. I'm waiting for her. As soon as she eats her pills, we'll go down the other end, okay? But I am going to make sure she gets those down before I go. She'll get them here in a second, and then we'll go down the other end. But they're going to join me. Here, <laughs> you guys are so silly. You're so silly this morning. You're going to eat. Don't worry about it. I think you could live off the land for a little while, don't you? Live off the fat of the land. Is that what they say? Yeah. I believe you'd be all right. Batman, I know you would. All of you. We'll get down there in just a minute. Now, the boys are being so patient. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> You're such good boys. You're such good boys. Yeah. Miss Smokey, old. She's almost got one more little cheese ball, honey. One more cheese ball, kiddo, and we'll uh, head that way and let you eat in peace. Eat that. There we go. She did it. All right. 
Got them all. Sweet. Got all our medicine down. All right. You guys ready now? Huh? It's your turn. It's your turn. It's okay. I know. He's a good boy. I know, Batman. He's a good boy. I know. Sometimes we just, you know, we get a little stubborn, but in the long run, he's just a good old boy. Just lovable. All of them. We just love you, don't we? We just love them all. There we go. All right, you guys ready? Come on, let's go, boys. Let's go. Come on, guys. You come with me. Now, Batman, you know, if I come out, you can't stick your head in there. You can't do it. Let's go. I'm going to get behind him here. Let's, let's encourage him. All. Let's go, boys. Come on, let's go eat. Well, Grandpa, is it raining? It ain't raining right now. How hungry are you? <sighs> you know. Let's go. Are you ready to go eat? Come on, let's go. Now, you know I can't just leave you here. Oh, Batman. If Batman goes, everybody will go. Come on, let's go, buddy. Come on. Let's go. Why do you make noises like that, Grandpa? What's a thing and the t and all that stuff? Let's go. Let's go, boys. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go eat. All right, out. You go first. You go first, and the boys will follow. Yeah, look here. What? It's, see, it's happening. Wait a minute. Look at there. She don't care much. Now, if he goes on up, look at this. They cannot leave that cat alone. All right, here we go. Now, we'll let her eat. Cat will follow us down. Wee! 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 That was fun. I liked it. We got her done. You ready, boys? Now, it's not raining terribly right now. So, uh, we'll go on down now. We got the boys. We can feed them inside. We can feed the pigs. They don't care about the rain. Just a little light sprinkle project. I made three more piles. Look at here. The other day when it was nice. One, two, three. Whew. Three more piles to burn. I don't know if I mentioned the last video or not. Somebody said, why don't you do a leaf burn? I think I said that's because they eat those brown leaves. I want to see how it comes up naturally. I got another pile. I'm going to clean this up. Two more piles there. Got it down to a fine art now how to <laughs> pile things up, burn things up, make it a little better. Oh, this rain, ladies and gentlemen, I tell you. When you have two, two or three days of 65, almost 70, and then you get slapped back into this, it's a heartbreaker. Heartbreaker. Okay, now I think they're down here. She's down there. I believe we can go ahead. I'm going to leave my umbrella right here. It's not raining that bad. The camera, I think, is a little bit water resistant, a little waterproof, something, something. So we'll uh, do it that way. The pigs are still in the shelter. Now, the two little ones here shortly will hear us. Trust me. And they'll come out loaded for bear. Here they come. You hear them grunting? Here they come. There's Bella. Miss Olivia. Oh, come on. <laughs> they're just cuter and cuter as cute can be. Oh, but they're so impatient. Miss Lola even heard them. She knows. They got up and she gets up and here we go. It's on now. I know it. Oh, I know. I know it. I know, girls. Hi this morning. How are you? How is everybody this morning? I know. It's raining.
whatever reason, I lost my audio. So we're going to do the rest of this. I'll, uh, no microphones, except for what's on the camera, okay? So this will be old school. Well, this will be uh, Chad school. How's that? Chad said, you know, Dad, one of the reasons I don't have microphones is because when I do it the way I do it, I never have to worry about my audio problems. He is exactly right. So we're going to go and finish this the old-fashioned way. And I have to figure out what happens to the microphone because I do like them. Because you know me, I'm kind of mobile, so I'm all over the place. Smoke's following me around. We still got to talk about, still got to talk about Smokey. But let's go ahead and give them a little bit of grain here. Hi, boys. Good morning. Oh, let's set this up here. I know it. What's the deal, huh? Let's get just a little bit of grain here, okay? Here, P. W. Here, somebody move over. Listen, or not, we're gonna share today. What we're gonna do? We're gonna share. You can. Here, we'll put it in there. We're not gonna get a hold of it. There we go. All right. Yeah, I leave that open now. And they love getting in there. Hey, Smokey, we're gonna talk about you in just a minute, okay? Now, Smokey, just so you know, that little girl. I think I. She gets out here in this rain she just walks around man she must have the thickest fur ever it must be true they got some they got a second coat of fur and maybe it's waterproof i'm not sure but yeah she'll get out here and just walk around ain't no big deal yeah let's put this up and then we'll uh talk about smoky and what the vet said and where we're at with that deal okay yeah, technology is great but i tell you what sometimes technology will let you down let you down and i wasn't checking and microphone shut off and here we are oh lovely day in the neighborhood what's up big man what's up big man you all right yeah oh you just nod your head yes you see that he nodded his head yes i said you all right he nodded his head he understands me yep we speak the same language smoky do we have to do this in the sprinkles huh we do it in the sprinkles or not all right let's talk about smoky and where we are I don't know if she'll come out of the rain or not, but we'll get in here and hang out with the goats and the birds. That's sassy. Hey, big man. Boy, you guys made a mess up there last night. Golly. You can't keep that clean up there. Man, fellas. I'll tell you what, if, if, if goats pooping is a good sign, you guys are helping us go to this side of the Mississippi. I'm here to tell you right now. All right, let's... Uh, come here, Smoke. What are you doing, honey? Hey, Smokey. Come here, honey. Come here, you want to come in here? Come here, you want to come in here? Talk to me? All right, come on. Well, she, she may come in a minute. That's all right. We'll just let her do whatever she's going to do. You get in here and get dry. Batman, you can help me out with this. You help me out. Got a urine sample a couple of days ago. Took it to the vet. They said the UTI. Here she is. She's in here now. The UTI is gone. That is great news. She's got a couple of days of the medicine left for the infection. I said, finish that out. There's still protein in her blood. That means, in general, that she probably has high blood pressure. All right? So he gave her a high blood pressure pill to take for three weeks, twice a day. The assistant told me that it is possible that could help her vision because High blood pressure makes your blood vessel swell, can affect your retina, affect your retina and so forth. So I'm hoping that after she's on this medicine for a few days, I don't know if it'll take a week, two weeks, whatever, that her vision will clear up. Because right now she's she's uh, she's still struggling, but she's only had four pills. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna get that. That's good news. The protein, it, it makes sense because it said if a dog has protein in her blood. She experiences exactly what Smokey is experiencing, even to the point of seizures, all right? And she, we know she's had at least one. I think maybe that's all she's had. I haven't noticed any, any other. So that's good news about Smokey. Uh, thank you for your prayers. You know, I, I just, I'm just hoping that this is it. She's still eating very, very good. Uh, wrapping her pills and cheese, she's getting it done. So everything else considered, she's okay. And she gets around fine. She knows her trail. She knows where she can go. Uh, so I think that's, uh, that's, that's, that's good news. It's a positive turn. 
so I, I we'll just be a little bit patient. Be, keep being patient on that on that front. All right, boys. Hey folks, we're gonna finish this in the garage if you don't care. It's uh, raining pretty good out there and it's just hard to hear when I'm talking either in the goat shelter or in the in the port of huts over there. And Smokey, she's up and down every place. So I had a couple of people ask about Miss Kitty and they were a little bit confused as to what cat is where and who's doing what, but how many we have. We have uh, Miss Kitty. And I know I told you last video that the gray tabby was gone, the dark one. She's back. She's hangs out over there the dark gray tabby was first showing up on the porch then miss kitty then we have a white one so we got three all together the white one and the dark gray tabby don't come around except they they don't come in the garage as far as i know right now miss kitty sleeps in here either on the lawnmower seat or she sleeps over there on the four-wheeler seat and i've got her some clothes for either whatever she wants to do but she's the one sleeping in here right now as far as i know the other two are probably truly feral cats. Miss Kitty may or may not have been. Some of you said she wasn't a feral cat. That's a possibility. But that's the scoop on the cats right now. Okay, Miss Kitty, here to stay if she wants to be. Miss Kitty, well, come here. Come here a minute. Come here, say goodbye to everybody. Come here. Come here, honey. Come here. Come here, Kitty Kitty. We were talking about you. Yeah. That's a girl. That's a good girl. I know. We're just a good girl. Get up here. Come here. I know you want my lap. Oh boy, there you go. Now, how's that? Oh boy. That's better. That's better. There we go. Well, hi everybody. Yeah, you're a little bit wet. You've been out there in the rain playing. You stink a little bit. You know what? That old wet fur stinks a little bit. Say, oh grandpa, I don't stink. There's no way. I can't stink. Oh, that's a good girl. That's a good girl. Okay. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, that's good. Okay, I got you. You better stay in the garage today. I'm gonna be all wet. You better stay in here, hadn't you? Folks, that's gonna be it for today. Thank you for sticking with me. Grandma's gonna have to do some masterful editing on this. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Thank you for sharing my videos with your friends. Appreciate that greatly. We love you all. Thank you for your prayers. God bless all of you. We pray for you. Miss Kitty, what do we say? Until next time, everybody. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, everyone. Say bye. Grandpa, hold my hand. Hold my hand, Grandpa. Yes. You snuggle. You want to cuddle?